So the other machine that we want to go over here is the upright tenant battery powered vacuum. Very simple, very lightweight, weighs a little bit less than eight pounds. You have a little carry handle right here. Very easy to pick up, maneuver, put on a clean cart, whatever you might need it for. Um, going over the machine, to get to our bag, we're gonna need to dump it, put a new bag on, undo these zippers. This right here is our main bag. You can see on either side, that we have two little notches. They have cut out arrows on both. Pull that down to release. And then you'll actually notice that when I remove this bag, I'm gonna pull it right here by this piece. It will actually close itself up so that I can go and dump it without the risk of spilling any of what's inside on the ground. You can see it's located a little bit more in the middle. So we wanna keep it full underneath where this little entrance is located. If you start to get fuller and fuller, you're really gonna be pushing how much you can do with this machine right here. So to put it back on, slide it back in. You can see when I push it in place, it opens that opening back up. Push this back up to the top until you hear that click. And then you can zip it up on the outside. On the back here is our battery. I can check to see how much battery life I have by clicking this little button. So we're at full battery right now. To take the battery off, hit that little yellow button right there. You can pull this up and you can charge it at your outlet. The charger can go directly in here, so I can either charge this while it's off the machine, or I can keep it plugged into the machine and just plug the charger directly in while it's sitting there. Underneath the machine is just our brush roll. To access this, you're gonna need your Phillips head screwdriver for just these two screws. Undo these screws, this plate will lift up and you can remove the brush. That is, if you can't actually cut around whatever might be stuck on it from right here, just go ahead, remove it, take care of your brush that way, then you can put it back on. To run the machine, my foot pedal release is located right here. And then I can snap it back into place like that. And then to start, hit my on button. Front light that will come on while you're using it. You're actually going to feel on the carpet that this machine is going to be propelling itself a little bit forward. So it should make it a little bit easier with that push and pull. It feels like it's doing some of the work for you. When you're done. Turn it off. Snap it back in place and put it back in your supply closet.